All right, hello everyone. We are back with Stray. So last we left off, we were looking for this girl Clementine. We are in apart her apartment. I don't know if she's here. And we're also in this massive city. That looks like there's a bunch of things to do. Um, we have to get a CD for a radio. And this dude who maybe will get mad at us playing some music, I don't know. But first things first. Gotta find Clementine. I think that's her name. I maybe just be like... Maybe that's some other memory I'm fucking up, but... Okay. I'm gonna explore the space here. somebody here oh it is clementine i thought you were sent never mind who are you what do you want wait so zibalthazar finally decided to send someone i guess you're my new recruit you're not very big how did you even manage the sewers i guess you were must be pretty resourceful i've been looking for a way to the the outside ever since I left the ant village, but the sentinels are always watching. Now that you're here, you can help. Follow me. Straight to the point. All right. I like it. The beautiful fucking apartment. Absolutely gorgeous. We're working on a plan to use this old subway for a while now. I even have the keys to start it. All we need is an atomic battery to power it. Lock and key quest, here we go. I know Neko Corporation has one secure inside their factory. Well, it's not really a lock and key, it's like a fetch quest. I have to go to their factory. I already know where that is. We couldn't get inside before. I have a contact who can help us infiltrate them. I don't know his name. He's the robot with a bomber jacket and a gl I know his name. I know who he is. He's the cool guy. And a gold chain. Take this message to him. Someone small and swift like you should have no trouble sneaking inside the factory. One last thing, don't hesitate to ask around for help. The city's full of information. Stay clear of the sentinels. Okay. Fair enough. So we need to get inside the factory. Okay. Look at this, man. The lighting in here, like the soft blue lighting and the... Just the ambiance of this area. Like, this is the kind of house I want to have. Like, maybe a little bit cleaner, but... Definitely, like, just as cozy. Just very, very, like, warm and welcoming. Like you could just sit here for hours and be totally cozy and just just chill. The feng shui, as they say. Although, yeah, my, my bathroom would be a little bit different than this. The living room's nice, at least. I mean, look at this. God damn. Hmm. I like it. Oh my god, I fucking love this. This is so cool. Look how cozy this shit is. I'm a sucker for like cozy places. There's a subreddit specifically for that. Just like places you'd want to hang out and just like read a book or listen to music. This is definitely one of them. Oh my god. I would die to live in something like this. All the places I've ever lived in my life have been honestly pretty garbage. 
Like, I'm not trying to sound ungrateful, but we never had a lot of money. Like, for one year, my family had a lot of money. Um, I'm not going to go into details, but we lived in a big house, and it was all right. But something like this is what I really want. By the way, that one year did not last. That's why it's only one year. We quickly, unfortunately, lost everything. Um, but yeah, like, I don't want a big place. I just want it to be nice. Like a one bedroom apartment, a one bedroom apartment. That's just like super chill and relaxing. Ugh. I'm a sucker. I'm a sucker for it. All right. What are you exactly? Quadru quadruped? Making cute sounds. I like the concept. Yeah. So, this guy mentioned something about shutting down cameras. And then he'll give me a CD. I want to see if I could do that first. Because there's a shopkeeper who specifically got angry about uh, kids and their music these days. And then there's a fucking radio in his back room. So I'm assuming there's a reason they've... I mean, it's an adventure game. There's hints everywhere for this shit. I think I already talked to everyone here, but... Where are these cameras that... That guy wants me to take out? Where are they at? Oh. Hey, dumb face, we can see you too. You see those three security cameras? There's three. There's one up there, one right there, and one right there, yes. Destroy them for us, please. You got it. Okay. Okay. How am I going to do this? Where are they? Did I just like hallucinate that? Where the f Where am I? Okay, I got all turned around. I don't know where the fuck Oh, it's over here. Wow. I just got completely turned around. Okay. What can I do here? One down. Um, there's one over there. And there's one right there. Okay. Uh huh. Excellent. Pretty easy. Okay. These cameras are not really built to last, are they? Just literally standing on them with a the cat will do it. Okay, that was barely a quest, but we got it. Alright. What's up, bros? Well done, I didn't think you could do it. I really didn't do anything, I just stood on him. Here, take your prize, you earned it. A cassette tape. Awesome. I know exactly where to take this. 
It's just so cool right now. So chill. Nothing bad for a. Yeah. Okay, here's my my educated guess. Being an adventure game player, we're going to go to this guy, play this cassette. He's going to get angry. We can then take something from his shop that we otherwise couldn't have taken. The reason being is the cool guy wants the latest cool thing from the shop before he'll let us in the factory is what I'm guessing is going to happen. So, I mean, let's do this. Let's do this the right way. Let's just go talk to the cool guy. Hello. Busy, what do you want? Where'd you get that? Oh, you're with outside my contact? Let me brief you about the atomic battery. Oh shit, am I just starting this accidentally? The battery is powering the Neko Corp factory right there, but this whole area is restricted and heavily guarded. I check every person who enters and turns away without any, without anyone who uh I check every person who enters and turns away anyone who's not a worker. That was hard for me. Here's an idea. Go get me a worker jacket and a worker helmet while I stay here and go check for a good time to enter. Now you might be thinking, Yuri, you're a genius. You're a prophet. Can I buy your latest book? And no, sir, I'm not a genius. I'm not a prophet. I played King's Quest. And I know exactly what the fuck these adventure games are like. They're like, oh, go get a thing, because this it's all connected. It's all connected. Uh, just one issue about this city being so big is I don't know where the fuck this shop- there it is. Okay, remember this dude? Are you one of those young punts listening to loud music all day? Don't touch anything, don't make any noise, don't ask for credit. Alright, so I need a worker jacket. Steel jacket. Uh-oh, this guy's gonna get mad. Uh, where's the helmet? I wanna do this in one swoop. Oh no, is the helmet somewhere else? And I have to go do another quest? I hope that's not the case, but I think it is. I don't know any other quest. I talked to like everybody, and I think. That's a basketball. Where are your hats, sir? I don't know. I, th I don't think he has helmets, which means I have to go find one. Uh, I don't see another helmet. Okay, that's that's kind of an issue because I feel like I've explored most of this city. I don't think I've seen a helmet for sale or for stealing. Um Wait. Okay, it's in here. What do you want? Nobody can enter the shop while it's being restocked. And seeing how incompetent those two are, it might be a while. Nice jacket, you work at the factory? Yes, and I need a helmet. I've been waiting for ages for Stuplocky to get back and help me restock these hats. The boss is not happy. If that guy is slacking off at the bar again, he has another thing. Okay, it's another quest. 
I have to go to the bar and I have to get stuck Locky to help unload. Hello. Wait, what? The guy in the back is absolutely well lubed, if you know what I mean. Only a big crash on the head could wake him. Oh my god. There's still gonna be somebody back. So there was no one back here the first time we came over here? Yeah, I know exactly what to do here. Do I play these games or what? I mean, it's not even fair. Yeah, get your ass back to work. I got stuff to steal. Oh, this is so fucking perfect. I was about to wonder, how the hell are they going to make me wait to unload all these boxes? Nope. This game is just too good. So perfect. God, I'm looking real smart in this episode. Usually when I play games, I look like a fucking idiot. But I'm calling everything ahead of time. Okay. We need a worker helmet. Easy. And we're gonna get away with it, too. Because we're a cat. No, I don't need to do that. I want to look around, though. See if there's anything else I can steal. I like how he uh, keeps bringing in boxes, too. I wonder if I just sit here long enough if it'll literally fill up with boxes. Unfortunately, I don't have that kind of time, but... Maybe I'll come back and see. Okay. So we've done everything. I don't think there's any other quests that I've seen yet. So we'll just continue with this one. Yeah, I got you one. I still need a worker helmet, yep. Excellent, this helmet will do the trick. I'll go get dressed now, mind turning around. These are great. A little snug around the waistline, but it'll do. Okay, hop in this box. I'll sneak you across the checkpoint. Awesome. This is great.
Now to find that battery. Lots of garbage. Oh, fucking shit. Okay, I didn't even see that robot. Alright. Stealth section, sick. Not exactly a fan of stealth sections, but... Try to get through it. And by get through it, I mean I'm going to lazily get past this pretty easily. Alright. <laughs> Hello, sir. Just a common worker here. No big deal. Just on point. All right, hold on. All right, sorry about that. My grandmother was half hanging off the bed. Like, her legs were dangling off the bed while she was sleeping. It'd be frustrating sometimes, trying to... It's not her fault, obviously. Dementia is brutal. It makes me sad. So I just, like, hit that lever. And I don't know what the hell just that did. What am I doing? What is going on? Alright, I'm starting to feel not so smart anymore. Oh. Okay. Duh. Um. Right. It opened that door. Not a fan of stealth sections in games. I'll be real. Bunch of lasers with us assume the battery I need. Oh, easy. I think. Okay, so there's three squares, and 
Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I'm going to need something. I'm gonna need this box. How do I get this box? You might be asking. Well, I don't know yet. Pressing random buttons, maybe. No. Come on, one of these has got to open it. There's a lever inside of there. Clearly, that's the box I need. There's a lever inside there, too. This lever's broken. I need another lever. Maybe. Damn, we use that chair. Okay, what is this? Oh, what the? in this game is not very hard. I'm grateful for that, honestly. I really don't want to be stuck here for 45 minutes trying to figure out how to get the boxes on the squares. I'm just commenting on that. That kind of a neutral way. It's a matter of fact way. Sometimes it's okay to have hard puzzles, sometimes it's not. It w I don't think it would work in this game. Okay, I see. Right. Easy enough. Well. That's not great. Got it. Quick, let's get out of here before the sentinels show up. Gotta get this battery back to Clementine. Alright. No problem with me. Don't mind me, just a casual cat. So, my prediction is that something's changed now that we have the battery. Yep. Figures. I was about to predict that Clementine wouldn't be there, but I didn't want to sound stupid. I should have just trusted my gut. Do you think the criminal is eyeing my collection of vintage cards? Hey, who do you think you are? You think you could stop us from hanging in our digs? You could steal our spot, but you can't steal our moves. All this work for nothing. Alright, well, I'm a cat, so... Remain calm as search operation is ongoing. Remain calm as search operation is ongoing. Oh, shit. Okay.
Oh. Fuck. Shit. Nothing to see here. Wait, so is there another entrance up to uh, floor three? That I didn't see before? Like another, oh, there is another staircase right there. Damn it, God damn it. Oh, I thought I could like be sneaky and like jump in a box real quick like last time. I think it's my first death. Not bad, first death. Oh, this is a long reset point. What the fuck? This sucks. I better not die again. That's awful. So that was the right thing to do, okay. Oh god damn it. I just knock this thing out. What, you don't listen to music? There's a banging track going on right now, dude. Alright. There's our apartment. Alright. Oh, for fuck's sake. Of course she's long gone. Clem? Hmm. No sign of Clementine. Oh, what's that? It looks like some kind of coded message. We're about to... We're going to have to play detective to figure out what happened. Well, if you know anything about me, is I'm a damn good detective. Look. For B12 and the cat, the answer lies in my stuff, and then there's four symbols. It's signed Clementine, take a look. Okay. Okay, we have what looks like a stand with a plant on it as number one. Number two might be another plant. Number three is a coffee table of some sort with a cone. And number four is obviously some sort of lava lamp. My sensors can only detect harmless chemicals in a gaseous state. They can't recreate the calming sensation I remember. Like me, companions can't smell, so I wonder why they do this. There's also a message in another container. It says, I'm with blank blank. So that's number one. 
yeah, 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 yeah. Wanted to inspect it. Okay, so yes, that was the first one. The second one's like a pod. I don't know what the fuck that is. I mean, this is not really a puzzle because I could just literally examine it when I get close to it. So I don't really have to look too hard. I'll just run at shit until it lets me examine it. There it is. This gem is a medium value and low purity. The glow seems to have been added artificially. Maybe it acts as a beacon for us to find something useful? Bingo. There's a message that says, I'm with Blazer. Blank, blank. Okay. Uh, I wish the interact button wasn't here. Because... Hmm. Found something? Huh, I don't see anything. Are you sure? Okay, so there's fake interactions. I've just been getting them all right. Eh, still. I, I wish, like, I had to actually, like, click on the thing myself. Then again, I could be here a while, but... Oh, there's the lava lamp, by the way. I don't know, maybe there's another one around here somewhere. There it is. I had no idea what this is, but it's glow is kind of memorizing. Sorry, I was elsewhere. I didn't even notice the message here. It reads, I'm with Blazer, blank, blank, nightclub. Okay, we're missing number three. Uh, which was, God, my memory is so bad. Seriously, guys, I have a terrible memory. Like, I don't know if it's because I've been living with an Alzheimer's patient for several years and it's like rubbing off on me or something, but my memory is awful. Um, yeah, it's like some sort of table. Uh, that's not it. Yes, that's not it. Like for the other game I'm playing, which is uh, Who Pressed Mute on Uncle Marcus, which is the most hilarious fucking title of all time for a video game. Uh, I've had to actually like write down like what I did before uh, in each session because I can't remember session to session what I've been doing. I have vague, vague recollections, but like not specifically what exactly uh, I hundred percent it or not. Uh, fucking hell, man. I guess let's get this. No. Oh, what an odd thing to have in an apartment. Is this a way the companions blah blah? It's kind of funny. Look, something's been left here. It says, I'm with, uh, what's his face? Blazer, come to nightclub. I'm with Blazer, come to nightclub. That's it, we've done it, Lieutenant Cat. Now let's go find her, we don't have much time. Uh, there was a bouncer who wouldn't let me in the nightclub, as I recall. Oh, do I have to fucking... No, there's gotta be another exit. No, I have to f go through that stealth section again. God damn it. That's kind of annoying. Alright, whatever.
Oh, what the fuck? Excuse me, pardon me. Oh my god, I'm so lucky. Yeah, nothing to see here, boys. Alright, I recognize I got lucky there. I was like 0.1 seconds off getting destroyed. Alright. Where the fuck am I going, by the way? Oh, I just went in a circle. Oh, never mind, I'm not that lucky. I'm stupid. Alright. Are you gonna turn around? No? Alright. Holy shit. Alright, that almost fucked me up too, but we're good. About this nightclub. I think it was at the entrance? Yep. Yeah. It's not for you, go away. I have a battery though. Drive, I don't take drives, so I buy my work. What is it anyway? Oh, what's up, bro? I hate this club, it's full of posers, but at least there's no sentinels in there. Danger, groove levels at 2%. Please fly the dancing spot immediately. I don't think the bouncer is going to let us in. Hey guys, I think we should... I think we're going to have to climb back at the back again. Okay. There is a back entrance. Oh. I guess you guys are stocked now? Hey, they did stock up. And they opened. Hello, sir. Hello, I don't have anything on your side. Sorry. I was curious about that. I'm glad we came back here. Um, there's a back entrance. Aha. I'm really excited to see this nightclub. Hello, Albert. I work hard to clean the streets, only for some to mess it up again. Anyway, that's how the world works. That it is. Ooh, some, some climbing. Oh, this guy's dressed nice. Hello, sir. Uh, he doesn't even want to talk to me, dude. He's like... Howdy, how you doing today? Well, howdy. Hello. Hey, how'd you get up here? You want to party with us? Hell yeah. Here, jump in and get a drink. Let's go, Alex. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, dude, look at those robots with the, the glow beds. Oh, this is dope, dude. Look at this guy. I like my mask, I made it my. I do like your mask a lot. It jams the Sentinel scans and it looks cool. It does look cool. Give it to the left, give it to the right. Beep, boop, sweep, swoop. It's called the Sigma Dance. Oh, yeah. Getting down. Dude, the guys who made the music for this game must have had so much fun. DJ Matsi. Hey, everybody. DJ Matsi here. Let's party. Let's get this party started. The first song has been requested by our very questionable friend, Blazer. Let's go. I know Blazer.
That's so awesome. Oh. There's something to do here. This is a sweet, sweet nightclub, dude. In all seriousness, this scene is very, very, very cool. Like, probably one of my favorites. Like, when I think about this game later, in like a couple of years, I'm gonna remember this scene. Just look. going what the hell that's not what I okay right back up please that is not what I wanted to do I want to talk to everybody hello hey customer the access to the VIB balcony is closed some private biz is going on in there has been reserved by some blazer guy, I think. Oh, he's up top. He's vaping. It's so funny. Oh, this guy's just... He's in his own world. paid extra to get night's dance moves from the bouncer. He's the one programming the holograms in his spare time. Dude, Anna is by far the best dancer here. Like, look at this. Hell yeah. many people in here. I'm surprised they don't let more people in. Oh, this club sucks. When I try to get to that stupid VIP room, they kick me out. Can you believe it? So I stole this lever just for kicks. If you get me a drink, I'll give you the silly lever. I don't need it. I don't want to get caught with it. Okay. This is why you talk to everybody, folks. I just got a quest. Oh, here's the drink. Synthetic. Jean Bulb Gold. Premium. Puve Synthetic. That's fucking awesome. Benzene. Wow. No, 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 no. No, no, no. Oh, no. It reor reoriented my character. Not yet. I want to get that lever. Alright, here you go, bro. This club sucks. Oh, thanks, my friend. Here you go, as promised. You're welcome. What did I do that for? Thank you. 
fuck is going on? What am I trying to do? It won't let me hit Q here. It won't let me talk to him. So the reason why I didn't jump on, because I saw the Q right there. Like I can hit that, but it didn't let me do it. Oh damn it! All right, hold on. Wait, then why did I need that lever if this lever works? There's gotta be something else to this. doing oh is this okay i think i understand the reason why i have to hit through this lever is because it's it's right there that's the vip room okay i don't want to go there yet i accidentally solved the puzzle without even knowing what i was doing i want to go down here and see what this is about When I was a human, my friends and I would gather at party long into the night, even when we had to suffer the annoying consequences the next morning. It felt good to find joy despite the unlivable service. And the underground living conditions become more and more squalid. And the capitalistic greed of companies like Neko Corp. And the police state created by the Sentinels. Now I remember why we were doing that. Oh wow, I missed so many memories. Jesus Christ. I didn't see any, but I don't know. Maybe when I was running past all those sentries, there were memories. Okay, I see. That was just for a memory. I get it. Alright. Let's go to the VIP lounge and see Clementine and Mr. Blazer. I didn't even know I could jump up there. What the fuck? Enjoying yourself, little one? Alright, I really gotta get- I just wanna stay in here all day. I gotta be able to do something with that. I don't know why it won't let me, but... Oh, wow. What the hell? Oh my god. This is awesome. That controls that one, I assume. What does it do? Oh, it's that one. But it brings two down. Let's see. I'm a blazer. I have a very good relationship with the Sentinels. I don't understand why people complain so much about them. What? What, did he see me and leave? What the fuck? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, 
shit. Two birds with one st I knew he wasn't that cool. Two birds with one stone. You're not as clever as you look, little cat. Anyway, nothing personal. Business is business. can't trust guys in blazers. It doesn't work like that. Business is money. I value money way more than our friendship or camaraderie. <laughs> I said both of those things wrong. It doesn't matter. They're all yours. Oh, she's sweating, dude. Oh, God damn it. Jesus Christ. We just got captured. What in the shit? Well, I hate to leave it here. <laughs> But I'm gonna, because this is too good to stop on. Wow, this episode, I fucking love this episode. I think this is my favorite episode of this game so far. Like, it was so good. Not only did I nail the puzzles, but like, it had nothing to do with me. It was just, the club scene was great. Her apartment was great. I didn't like the stealth section so much, but it was painless. I mean, I died once. Like, the factory was fine. Like, stealth sections are fine games, but I, I find them annoying when they get too hard because you're just like over, you're just replaying the same thing over and over again. And it gets annoying. Uh, but that wasn't, that wasn't like that at all. It was actually really easy. Um, so I didn't mind it. I'm very excited to see what happens next year. This is, I'm guessing we're captured by Necocorp or maybe we're captured by the Sentinels. I don't know. They seem to be two different things. I think Necocorp is like bought from the boys or Walmart in our day, Disney. Like the big company. And then there's the government itself, which are the Sentinels. So I wonder who captured us here. I think it's the Sentinels. Uh, but we'll have to see you next time, guys. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate you, and bye-bye.